the Holy Grail. One sip from it, it is said, can cure all ills. Legend tells how after the crucifixion, it was the cup used by one of the disciples to collect a few drops of Christ's blood. The legends disagree as to which follower of Jesus this was, some saying it was Joseph of Arimathea, others that it was Mary Magdalene. During the Middle Ages, tales were written of how the early followers of Jesus brought the Holy Grail to Britain, where it was later sought by the Knights of King Arthur. It is eventually found by Sir Percival, who sees it being held by a beautiful maiden during a banquet at a mysterious castle. The place is referred to only as the White Castle in the White Town, and such a place does exist. This is the White Castle in the town of Whittington, and the name Whittington comes from Early English, meaning literally White Town. The ruins of Viraconium, which my research suggests was the historical Camelot, lie just a few miles to the southeast of Whittington. Remarkably, the Fitzwarrens, a family that lived here during the Middle Ages, actually claimed to have possessed the Grail. It was said that they kept it in the castle chapel. Its ruins still survive. An ancient relic believed to be the Holy Grail may well have been kept here during the Middle Ages. It certainly seems to have been the location of the Grail Castle that the medieval writers had in mind. But Whittington Castle was only built in the 12th century, over 600 years after the time that Arthur is said to have lived. But nearby, there is a fortification called Dinas Bran that is very much older. What remains of its ancient weathered grey stone walls stand on top of a thousand foot steep sided hill looking out onto the mountains of Wales. During the period in which the earliest accounts set King Arthur's life 1500 years ago, this was the site of a Dark Age hill fort. It would have been a Roman style fortification, surrounded by a series of defensive ditches and embankments. Although this was not a castle in the medieval sense, it seems to have been here that the story of the Grail Castle originated. In the medieval Arthurian romance, Percival is shown the grail by a maiden accompanied by a young man holding a spear from which drips blood. A much earlier Dark Age Arthurian tale has a Welsh hero called Peridur witnessing an almost identical scene. And in this narrative, the story is set here at Dinas Bran. The fort is named after a mythological Celtic hero called Bran, who is thought to have lived here, and was said to be the guardian of a number of mystical relics. In the Arthurian saga, a very similar sounding Bron is said to be the guardian of the Grail. So it's just possible that an object believed to have been the Holy Grail was kept here during the period Arthur is said to have lived and later moved to the White Castle at Whittington where it became incorporated into the ever-evolving romance of King Arthur.